what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to some more walking dead season 9 gonna be doing two more episodes today 11 and 12 man series is moving along quite nicely <clears throat> season is top tier no doubt one of the best seasons of the walking dead and i'm not even done with it yet and i can already say that because um now we have this girl's mother showed up i think her name is lydia if i'm remembering correctly because this is a different day um lydia is interesting she's she was broken as a child she don't know what to believe and now her mom shows up gonna make her even more confused in my opinion and i don't think she's gonna know i think maybe Tara is going to hand her back off or Daryl is going to be against her going back to such an abusive mom. Um, you know, they talked about the switching, <laughs> the switch, you know, the switching, you know, um, I, I got beaten, beat as a child. When I grew up, I never looked at it as being abusive. There were times I remember if I should tell this story, you know, I remember when I was a child and my mom was beating me with a belt and she accidentally hit, hit me with the buckle. And I think it's the only scar I have in my head. Um, it's actually somewhere. I don't remember where, where it is, but it's somewhere in my head. Every, in time, if I cut my hair bald, I could probably show you that scar. Um, and she was absolutely sorry for it. She never meant to hit me with with the belt buckle. You know what I'm saying? So, and, you know, she told me sorry so many times. I thought, you know, what I did was, <laughs> was right. I don't even remember what I did. I think it was like a, it was, I mean, now that I actually think about it, what I got beaten over was so stupid you know what I'm saying? But it was a lesson to be learned, no doubt. You know what I'm saying? I don't think any of the beatings I got, I did well, from my mother, <laughs> I didn't deserve. My dad was definitely abusive, in my opinion. My dad was definitely abusive. Um, don't hate him, but he was definitely abusive. He, the chances that he got to beat he find he found he looked for the most violent things or ways to do it you get what i'm saying it's not i'm not against beating children i think kids should get a whooping you get what i'm saying i think kids should get a whooping that's just my opinion on it i'm not telling parents out there to go out there now and abuse their kids I'm saying I do the I, I you know a child can get slapped. Don't be punching them in the face or no shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Slap them. You know what I'm saying? Slap them on the hand. Use a belt. Listen, sometimes kids needs to learn, but you know this is America. You can't do that. I'm not encouraging people to do that. I'm just saying where I'm from, I'm Jamaican, and you know there were all the beatings that I that I think that were abusive. They came from my dad never from my mother so um when it comes on to that switching thing like i've gotten beaten with switch you know what i'm saying from stuff from trees and and stuff like that and it's not nice you know what i'm saying but there's a very thin line when it comes on to actually beating your kids for a purpose and um where it trickles over into um abusive behavior you get what i'm saying so it's like because there's such a thin line i can understand why america makes it a standard you know to probably even take away your kids if you're if you're beating them in any capacity at all you get what i'm saying so i can understand you get what i'm saying and you're looking at it objectively i can totally understand because it's a very thin line it's a very thin line you get what i'm saying because you can be beating your child and going overboard and don't think you're going overboard. You get what I'm saying? So you might as well not do it at all. And I get it. And I think there's a lot of kids out here that needs a whooping and they ain't getting none. But that's just my opinion. But when it comes on to Lydia, I, I definitely think that she's in an abusive 
um her mom is definitely abusing her i mean leaving marks like that on your kids come on man like that's crazy i mean you could see that she's going overboard with what she's doing you know you can see that she's going overboard and as i said you know what i'm saying there's a very thin line but anyways they have showed up at hilltop the mom is there and she's come back for her daughter i don't know how true that is but let's see how this conversation ensues and we will see how it goes anyways thank you guys so much for listening to me talk about whoopings and i will catch you guys later for the review <laughs>
um, that you heard that you hear me talking about a little bit of hiccups, but it's not anything that takes me out of, you know, watching the show or I'm not enjoying it or anything like that. It's just that I like when stories flow in a certain way. I like when people get time to find things out. I like, I don't, you, you can't just bring up stuff casually in a conversation and we didn't, you know, me over here thinking that they don't know. And then all of a sudden they're talking about it. It's like, who told you that Negan got out? You get what I'm trying to say? Did they come through? Did they come back through the, the front gate? And he just went to his cell? Like, it would have been nice to see a scene like that. What the hell happened? Because you heard me talking about it in the last reaction where I was like, it would be nice if they had a scene of of, um, of Negan and Judith coming through the gate and Michonne coming in at the same time. That would have been an awesome scene to be seen, right? But they just forego all of that and just say, uh, oh, let's just let her talk about it you know what i'm saying so that kind of threw me off a little bit but it, it, it's no big deal anyways thank you guys so much for tuning in as always make sure you hit that like button leave a comment in the comment section let me know if you enjoy both of these episodes of course subscribe if you're new it's your boy terabyte reacts man i'm out peace